Unlicensed teachers, NBA tanking, and Kimmel versus Trump. I'm Justin Mack, and this is The Drop. New legislation looks to address the shortage of Indiana teachers to staff public schools by turning to unlicensed teachers. Lawmakers say that some potential candidates are getting hung up on the state's licensing exam after performing well in other aspects. So Senate Bill 387 would allow for schools to fill up to 10% of their teaching staff with unlicensed teachers that meet certain criteria. Unlicensed teachers, that's crazy. But... If laws are passed that force teachers to be armed, would unlicensed teachers need licenses for their handguns? You know what, forget it. Forget I said anything. Moving on. The USA Today is reporting that sources have told them that the NBA has warned the Chicago Bulls about resting healthy players and tanking their season. Now, the association isn't fond of the idea of teams losing on purpose to secure higher draft picks. They even fined Mark Cuban $600,000 for saying that losing would be in his team's long-term best interest and afterwards sent out a memo to all teams thinking about doing that not to. So with all the fines and warnings flying around, teams like the Hawks, the Nets, the Suns and the Grizzlies have come forward to assure the association that they are not tanking. They're just trash. And finally, Jimmy Kimmel and President Donald Trump continue to be at odds. This time, it's a little bit of post-Oscars Twitter beef. After the Oscars aired, President Trump tweeted out something about the lowest-rated Oscars in history being because there's no real stars anymore except for him. He said he was kidding about that part. In response, as host of the show, Kimmel tweeted, thanks, lowest rated president in history. Ouch. But lowest rated Oscars, lowest rated president, is it really a surprise? If you look around, you can kind of see that disliking everything is kind of the new hot thing. What a time to be alive. That's it for The Drop. I'm Justin Mack.